This is pretty representative of what we're seeing in Sioux Falls. A uh, dramatic drop in visibility as a snow squall is pushing through town right now. We're picking up some pretty good snow rates, and I know the timing is not good on that, just as we're ready to get out on the roads. Notice uh, the street department is out and busy. There is a snow plow right there at 14th of Minnesota. They're going to be busy here the next uh, few hours just trying to get these emergency routes treated. Obviously, when it's snowing at a pretty good clip, at 6.40 in the morning, it is a little challenging because I know many of you are just, yeah, all getting out there on the road. So just give yourself a little extra time. That's the best advice here. Now, I want to show you what's happening on radar. This explains what we have. And the darkest blue color, which, of course, right now includes Sioux Falls, uh, right there, northern Turner County, northern Lincoln County. It's interesting, though, as you see the loop of the radar, that there is a, a really a pretty big decrease in the snow around Yankton and up to it looks like probably about Highway 18 right now. So Menno and Hurley just on the edge of that. So that is some encouraging news, at least that we're not going to be dealing with snowfall rates this heavy all morning. But what we want to tell you is up front that this first batch is uh, pretty significant. It's going to continue to lift north. I fully expect as it gets into the winter weather advisory areas north of Sioux Falls, it continues to fill in. This is the scan on the Huron radar, and uh, the colors again represent the darker colors, at least the intensity of the snow, all the way from Watertown to Aberdeen. So that's